Hey y'all. So we are here with the homies. And where are we going? I'm going to the the museum, right? We are going to the National Portrait Gallery to see the Obama's portrait. Are you excited? Yeah. I'm like, are y'all excited? Are you excited? <laughs> what in the world? Are you excited? Yeah. <laughs> do yeah. they look excited to y'all? No. no. They go. don't, do, do they? And this look blurry. I gotta look like the three. So, we are meeting some of the other homies here. So this is so cool, let me show y'all. Oh, black in the door. Carla's <laughs> shocked that she's somewhere early. <laughs> she's like, why am I somewhere in the I know. So y'all remember Kim? Look, you know how we do Kim. <laughs> and there's Hannah Banana. Y'all remember Hannah Banana in Long Island? And there is Tony. Y'all remember her? I don't know if y'all remember her. And Carla. I'm her daughter. Yeah. <laughs> All right, y'all, so we are at the National Portrait Gallery. Which has another name. It does? Yeah, yes. it has. It's like the Donald Trump. The Donald Trump building up, right? You better not. You better not. We, we have to leave right this moment. <laughs> well, right now, we know it as the National Portrait Gallery, and this is where the Michelle Obama and Barack Obama's portraits are being hosted. So, it's the Donald W. Reynolds Center for American Art. Important. Go ahead, you can say it. Portraiture. 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 Go, portraiture. Come on, like, what, what, come on, right English teacher. Portraiture. From New York. I'm an English teacher from New York. <laughs> but you, y'all know English teachers from New York are like over six figure salaries, right? They are not the struggling English teachers that y'all read about in the news. Yeah, they are not those teachers. They actually get tenure in elementary school. <laughs> like, who does that? <laughs> And so, Hannah yeah, Banana, how old are you? Uh, twelve. Oh, oh my goodness! And so, Monty, you're ten, right? And you're twelve, Isaiah. And you're twelve, Elijah. And you're nine. So, yeah. Look at this is pretty. I was gonna say I forgot that Heather said that this is a place where you can have like lunch or you can bring like your own picnic or whatever. And it's like, oh so cool. We can't touch anything. And don't touch the radiator. <laughs> don't bump into it. <laughs> Thanks for listening. <laughs> Oh, 
Ooh, that was risky. Ooh, I felt myself wobble towards the end. So which president is this? Yep, George Washington. Not in law, but he's not the first person. Yes, he is. It's not. You know what? It's George Washington. This is the Fred W. Smith Gallery, but that is a picture of George Washington. I don't know who Fred W. Smith. Oh, this is painted by Gilbert Stewart. When I was in Rhode Island, I went to Gilbert Stewart Elementary School. Isn't that pretty cool? So guys, so we are here at the Donald's at the America's President's Exhibit, and what we learned is so that Michelle and Barack Obama they're not displayed together. Why? Because he's the president. Right. So he's with other presidents. He's with other presidents here. So right now we are in line so that we can take our picture with his picture and leave. No. We'll go see Michelle. No. Yes. Then we'll go see Michelle. Obama picture. How do you? You love that painting. What painting? Michelle Obama. You know, like put people on the spot. I think art is wonderful because it's all in the um, eye of the beholder. Her politically correct answer. Yeah. <laughs> How do you like it, Kim? I think it was beautiful. You like the dress she made. She was wearing. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So we can't wait to see it in person. See how we really feel. We rocked her portrait like she rocked being in office. She didn't rock being in office. Different. She different. She different. She different. Oh, different. She Barbara Jordan over there. Different. you guys think? It was good. Uh -huh. It was good. What was you about to say, Isaiah? It was good. He don't like nothing because he don't like people. All right, Elijah, come. What did you think? Oh, no. oh I like the slip and slide. I like the slip and slide. What did you think? The slip and slide. The slip and slide. Oh my goodness, I can't. What did you think? See, this is why I talk. This is why my channel's for adults. What did you think, adult? No, hold on. What did you think? I liked it. It was nice. It was very great pictures, and I just, just wanted to do that one day. You want to go off? No. What did you want to do? What one day? You captured like. I thought it was everything that I expected it to be. So what does that mean? Art. What I love is that it resonates a different vibration with the viewer. You know what? Let me keep it real. Because they don't know how to keep it real. All right, guys, this is what I think. What do you think? I 
love the fact that we got the opportunity to come out here and see these portraits in real life for yeah. real, right? Come on over. Okay, that was fun. Come on. Because yes. I've never done it even though I live here, so this is fun for me. Exactly. Yeah. We're in the D.C. area and they have all of these things to look at and explore. And this museum, this gallery is huge. And it's beautiful. There's just it so really much is. to see. I couldn't even imagine how long it would take to see oh everything. Gosh. They said you can't see it all in one day, like really see it and take it in. Yeah. Oh, yeah. But the thing I really liked about um, our former president Barack Obama's picture mm. is how vibrant it was compared to all the other portraits of the president. It pops. So it was really different, really um, just groundbreaking, trailblazing, and that was super dope. I think my second favorite picture was um, Reagan. No, the one that rocked Nixon. Nixon. Oh, Nixon. Picture. Nixon. Yes, that Norman it was, it Rockwell. It so real. His hand, like it looked like he was gonna walk off of the Nixon. Yes. Michelle Obama's picture? I'm still not feeling it, I'm sorry. It doesn't look like her. It's, it's kind of dull. even it's dull. less impressive in person. We were hoping we were gonna feel this sensation and like get all right. Unfortunately, I mean, it just wasn't symmetrical. Things just was a little off. Did you notice that, Kim? I know oh, she had a hair out of place. Kim noticed she had a hair out of place. But you know something it. in Mona Lisa's picture? Mona Lisa's part too is supposed to be centered, but it's off. It's off. Yeah. So maybe she was channeling her inner Mona yeah. Lisa. Hell. So maybe that's what was happening. Um, yeah, and I, we're supposed to be fans. I mean, what I love is that this African American artist did it. That is super dope. I mean, because we don't see that too often. Um, First Lady, that was super dope. That was awesome. But that painting was a little underwhelming for me. I would have preferred for anyone to have painted it and it really captured my First Lady. Yeah. So I mean, that's nice, but I don't feel that she did her justice. I'm gonna go point out the flaws of it to Kim. She didn't see it. We'll be right back. Oh my gosh. All right. Tell us. So she loves, she loves old Miss so Michelle I don't, Obama's I don't think picture. I love it. Okay, I she appreciate it. This lady in Florida did one of Mrs. Obama. And I mean, she's standing in front of it, but I just thought that that was So cool. that is stunning, and that's a more realist type picture. of But you're painting. saying that her painting is more. So I don't know what the how they would call that type of painting mm -hmm. but clearly it's not a realistic it doesn't capture her realistically it's more fantasy like so you could turn that off more it's not surreal. like you're gonna post this because now Why i sound not? like an idiot no you don't but it, it's, it's like more, it's more surreal it's more so surreal it's, it's so not once a you let it go to the artist you just gotta say it's their creation and you have to respect whatever the artist and creates. you know what it is i guess also with art art can be so in your face that either you have immediate love reaction right. that either you know you love it or you know you like it or you know you appreciate it or you know you don't mm -hmm. and you don't i didn't <laughs> i didn't um yeah i didn't i wanted to i wanted to i i really wanted to and i like i said i appreciate the artist i appreciate everything that this means for history but yeah. And I appreciate that Michelle will find someone to help further their career. Like yes. That is a part of her story. True. Hey, yes. Most definitely. So, so I can appreciate all that that painting represents. So there you have it, y'all. That is our visit at the National Gallery Museum or National Portrait Gallery. National Portrait time. Gallery. We did. Now we're going to take these babies and get them something to eat.